All right, so I want to talk about something and not something that y'all are used to me talking about, but I kind of want to talk about efficiency or how to work smarter. And it's, it's not the word efficiency, it's about how to work smarter, okay? So let me tell you what happened uh, yesterday. So yesterday was a really awful stormy day. It was cold, it was 39 degrees, it was raining sideways, it was bad. I thought the rain was actually gonna turn into snow. I was like going, when is it gonna be snow? It never turned into snow. It was just rain and it was cold rain. So that's why I kind of snuggled up. I got like, uh, you know, one, two, three, four shirts on today. I'm snuggling on, I'm in front of this dumpster that's right here, they, man, I'm telling you, they made a mess out of this dumpster. But anyway, here, here's what I wanna talk about. I went to the landfill in the morning, and when I get there, I got there really early, like 7.30, 8 o'clock, somewhere around that time. When I pull in, it's only me and this other white truck. It was a white truck, and on the side, it said hauling on the truck. So when I pull up, I see this guy, and it says hauling on the side. And I look, and I'm like, okay. I stop, and I said, hey, man, how's it going? My name's Ricardo. He goes, oh, I know who you are, blah, blah, blah. Uh, you're out of Dallas. And I'm like, okay. I go, yeah, where are you from? He goes, Fort Worth. I said, oh, okay. I said, well, what, are you, what are you doing in Fort Worth? I mean, what are you doing in Dallas? He goes, oh, we dump in Dallas because it's cheaper. And I'm like, oh, okay. I said, wait a minute. Fort Worth? He's dumping in Dallas because it's cheaper than dumping in Fort Worth. Now, I said, no problem. Later on that evening, I, I went to go do a big job, so my truck was full and I needed an empty trailer. So this is the only trailer that I could use that's not stuck at the haunted house still that we haven't took down. Later on that afternoon, around 3.30, 4 o'clock, I went back to the landfill and I was dumping all the trash from that day's work. When I got there, this guy pulls up again. And I'm like, oh, hey man, what's up? He, I said, that's funny, I see you again. He goes, yeah, you must, dump, you must dump here a lot. And I'm thinking, yeah, I do dump here a lot. So he's a local guy, I don't know who he is. I, I didn't get his name, um, just the, the truck. It was a white truck and it says hauling on the side. So I stopped by and I said, hey, what's up, man? What are you dumping in? He goes, oh, it's, I have a big house. It's an eviction house or something like that. And I'm just cleaning it out. It's way in Fort Worth. I said, oh. I said, well, how much is the dump in Fort Worth if you're dumping way in here in Dallas? And I said, he said, oh, it's $98 per ton. 98. I'm like, oh, okay. Yeah, 98 bucks isn't that bad. Um, wait a minute. Why are you dumping in Fort Worth, I mean, in Dallas then. Okay, so here's what happened. Apparently, he's taking all the trash that's in Fort Worth and driving it 33 minutes at 32 miles. He's driving it all the way down, right, to, let me decline that call. He's driving it all the way down to Dallas. He's picking up another load and driving it all the way down to Dallas you got to think smart on something like this, okay? The dump is actually nine minutes away from my headquarters, okay? It's only nine minutes. That's where I dump all the time. I strategically think smart every time I dump, okay? Always. Every time I dump, I'm thinking smart. I purposely dump only when my trailers are loaded and depending on the geolocation of where I'm at. This guy doesn't want to dump in Fort Worth because it's $98. So he drives his trash all the way from Fort Worth to Dallas to dump. The dump fees in Dallas are 68. 68 bucks. So he's taking $68 and $98. He's only saving 30 bucks. But here's what happens. You're going to save $30 doing that, but you're losing time and you're losing efficiency. Because don't forget, when you drive from Dallas to, I mean, from Fort Worth to Dallas, it takes 33 minutes. And that's without traffic. 33 minutes back, that's without traffic. You're losing one hour worth of work to save $30. Oh, and I forgot, there's this little small thing called fuel. Fuel costs money. So if you're spending too much fuel to drive 33 minutes and 33... 32 miles each way. That's ridiculous. You're spending 64 miles. Dude, I'm telling you, 
it's a waste of time. I would have just paid the $98. And, and I always think in my head, dude, you got to think smarter. When you're working, and this is for people starting a junk removal company. When you're working and you're starting a junk removal service, think smart. Don't be dumb. You have to think smart. Because the next guy next to you, your competitor, is thinking smarter than you. You have to be able to establish the way you make money in a more efficient way and a more smarter way. This guy is not thinking smart. He's taking all his trash from forwards and taking it all the way to Dallas to save 30 bucks. But what's he losing in return? Time, fuel, and wear and tear on his vehicle. And get this, I noticed one thing when he was dumping. He's got three guys dumping with him. There's three guys dumping with him. So it's him and three guys are in the truck with him. So that's one hour each guy. That's Let's just say he's paying each guy 10 bucks an hour. Let's just say that. That's 30 bucks every time you take it to the landfill because there's not a break. You're on the clock on the drive to the landfill and back. So he's not saving money. He's spending the same amount of money. But what he's deciding to do is spend more money and, and and put more wear and tear on his vehicle and fuel costs. So always take those things in consideration. If you're spending an hour. And you know what's weird about it? I don't know why he used three guys if his trailer's a dump trailer. He only needs himself dumping. But apparently he never got out of the car. And it was weird to me that he never would step out of the vehicle and let these guys dump his trailer. Anyway, guys. Think smart when you're doing the junk removal. Don't be dumb. Think smart. Hey, I'll talk to you all later, guys. And I hope this video helps you be more efficient and smart. Bye-bye, guys.